Hello again everybody and welcome back to more of Let's Play Outlaw Golf. In the last part, we took care of that one event. Yeah, so let's go and get started. Sorry, I got a little excited there. And, yeah, I was just fucking around for a little bit there. And yes, yeah, so I don't really care about F-bombs right now, so yeah. Even though I just said F-bomb to be, you know, sort of censor-ish. I don't know. But, yes! I am so tired that I'm hyper. It's ridiculous. So I'm like, you know, you know, you know, you know, like that, but that, uh, the, the title of my second video. And yes, I skipped character intros because we uh, are only doing a nine hole match against somebody we've already played against before. So, no need to character in to character in to get yeah, character intro dice. I, I don't know what, what, what the hell I'm saying. That's a real bushism right there for you. Introduce or introduce -er. Yeah, introducer. <laughs> I can imagine that one. Thank you, Dick Cheney. Mr. Introductor otherwise. <laughs> now, but, uh, in this, if you couldn't tell already, which you probably couldn't, um, uh, the we got the boilermaker driver in the last event and we actually can actually use our drivers again yay instead of reverting the three wood because our drivers are pathetic uh... in El Suave's drivers like 252 which is pretty good I say I mean it's not great because of the fact that uh... you know because of the you know increased statistics but that's okay in the end it all works out because I think if I'm not mistaken uh... that everybody's um, drive totals when all the attributes are maxed out or well most of them are maxed out you, they still end up the same Trixie distance like Trixie would be able to hit 307 I would be able to hit 307 Killer Miller would be able to th hit 307 Ice Trey would hit 307 I think I mean I might be wrong about that but I'm pretty sure that's the case that would be kind of unfair anyway though if they did so yeah I didn't start off this hole too great it was kind of ridiculous because uh because when Trixie hits the, you know, she hits a full shot about, you know, about the distance to the pin. You know, like it says 149, she'll use the club that says like 150 or 151 and it actually rolls up on the green and then I do the same thing and it actually ends up in the rough, so. I don't know how that works or why that happens, but oh well. <coughs> And when I said that she was one of the toughest players in the game, I'm, I might have been lying about that a little bit. Because... Apparently her weakness is uh, putting. Or so I would presume from this match. Um, I know characters generally don't show weakness or any of any form. Like... Uh, like Trixie for putting or whatever like that, but she seems to be really good at chipping. Third so it seems. Even though she doesn't do a really good job right there, so... Kind of defies logic in a sense, I don't know. <coughs> El Suave is shooting but, for a um, at a birdie. But in previous attempts, here I go again, uh, she missed a lot of putts. She missed like easy ones, like ones that were like almost dead straight. Actually, once she, she, the ones that she did miss were dead straight, but she had aimed them like they weren't. <coughs> Which was kind of weird, but oh well. Uh, I, I took it for the time. Well, I mean, I didn't really take it, but you know. I mean, I took it, but you know, it didn't really matter in the end, so. <sighs> so yes, now we can hit 270 off the tee. I mean, a pretty good distance, you know. Compared to... Maybe 260 if we got lucky. I mean, well, yeah, 260 if we got lucky. I mean, I guess it's not really that big of a difference because because we're only 10 yards. Um, yeah, we're only hitting it 10 yards further than we were before, but you know, it's still worth noting because we hadn't been able to really hit it that far the entire game. 
I mean, the attributes are probably what helped the most, but but because of the clubs and everything like that, we haven't been able to really hit it that far. So. Second shot. And yes, I did this as one part because. Uh, I, s I think I said it before, I'm pretty sure did, that I would try to make most of these one part if possible, which this one I just had to hurry it up a little bit. I mean, it's a little more than what I normally would do for time, but but it's still fine. Um, I think it's still pretty good time for, I mean, I think it's still a decent time for a nine hole match video like this one. Though I've probably done, I've, I mean, though I know I've, you know, had better times, you know, but still. And that was a terrible shot. I did not like that one at all. I did not like the way he hit that at all. I mean, I tried to adjust the power because I thought, oh, it's going to go like 500 yards over. And then I was like, oh, wait. And then I realized in the end that I was in the rough. So that's why I came up so short. But, oh, well. Again. That's going to make you feel good about your golf game. Trixie has a chance for a crack at a birdie. <laughs> We're at the four. El Suave is yeah. about to put club two ball on the team. You know, it kind of sucks a little bit. Um that I didn't really get I don't really have much of a choice to play besides with uh with any but any other characters besides you know just El Suave and Ice Tray and Summer and Harley but I think that if there was one of the four if there was out of all the characters if they were actually one of the original four that were on the cover or you know yeah on the cover or you know we're already unlocked and all that stuff. I think Killer Miller should have been one of those four. In my opinion. This ball is on the green and looking mighty fine. But I guess they were just being very um, diverse with their um, with their profile backgrounds. Go. I guess that's what probably why he was. That's probably why else was was part of that. So it'd be completely diverse because you know. There's, you know, Ice Trey, who's like this gangster wannabe, this, you know, gangster or like that, and then there's a someone who's the beach blonde or whatever, who's like a complete idiot, and then there's El Suave, the, you know, the, uh, the Hispanic, you know, or, um, yeah, I think he's Hispanic, but, uh, you know, you know, this romantic, you know, Hispanic, like that's no, uh, like that's no pun intended, right? Uh, and then there's Harley, you know, the kind of the tough redneck girl in a sense, you know, biker redneck girl. You know. That probably doesn't even make sense, biker redneck. Or at least it wouldn't to me, because rednecks are they don't drive, they don't ride motorcycles, they just drive trucks. I might be wrong about that though. Can't say a not can't say that you know it's worthy of judging you know but in fact because it isn't but you know either way you know there's that thing on the bottom that says YDS I don't even know what that stands for I don't even know if like when I'm recording and all that stuff I don't have I don't ever have a clue if I actually see that at any point in this game. Or if I just don't pay attention to that. And I keep telling myself to check it, and, but I don't. Nah. <coughs> Whatever. Uh, this is what also annoyed me, is that... This hole right here, is that... The way that Trixie does it seems to be like the only way to actually do it. Uh, because if you do it any other way, you're screwed. I mean, like, you don't have any chance of getting even within five yards of the hole. Or if you do, you got really freaking lucky. Uh, because, 
again, back to my previous attempt story, uh, she actually almost got a hole in one. Like, she was only like a foot away from a hole in one. When she, like, she did that same method except for she actually aimed it more properly and got a hell of a lot closer. And, yeah, I was not very happy about that. I mean, that, um, <clears throat> And it wasn't that I was gonna lose. I just got. I simply just got too frustrated with it. Um, so that's why. I, that's why I um, stopped most of those attempts. Uh, my first attempt was actually because it didn't really go through. You know, of course. But uh, and I, I actually ran out of time at, at the sixth hole. So I was like, okay, I'll just you know do the next part or something like that. And then I didn't didn't really help out. So I mean, so I'm kind of glad that that. Uh, attempt got, you know, got, um, had to get, had to be deleted, you know, so. Uh, and then that this one came through, because this one was a heck of a lot, this one was better for me, anyway. I didn't get as nearly frustrated or, you know, annoyed or whatever. Mm. So it's like 5 in the morning right now, and I am... I mean, I've been up, let's see, since, I want to say, about 7 p.m. yesterday, something like that, and, uh, you know, normally I take a nap around midnight for some reason, but I didn't, and somehow that's made me, like, super tired. Um, but... I mean, and this is, a uh, yeah, this is 5 a.m. the next day from the, or 5 a.m., five hours after the recording the attempt center. of, uh, or yeah, the recording Tracy session of, uh, the 10th video, I believe it is, yes. Yeah. Or, is it 10th? Yeah, I think it's the 10th video. Yeah, because this should be number 11 right here, so, yeah, it is number 10, sorry. <coughs> Yeah, it's only five hours afterwards, because, I mean, I, I was like, okay, I'll just do some recording just to get a little further ahead, and then I was like, I mean, and I felt, and I wanted, and I really wanted to, so I was like, okay, why not, you know, and, uh, then I, then I was, and then I was messing around on my keyboard, and I was like, uh, and I still had the game on, I, <laughs> I didn't play it for almost four hours, but, I mean, I still, kept it on for some reason, so I was like, okay, I'll do one more recording session, and then, uh, yeah, just do one more video recording, and then just call it good, for, for now, and when I mean video, I mean, like, as in either episode, or, you know, basically to the end of the event, because I'm not one of those people who can, who can cut off, um, no, I don't know. I don't think there's anybody on this planet who can actually cut off in the middle of a, a round or a game or something like that. Um, there must be something going on at home. And then just say, and then be able to go like, oh yeah, keep it here all night because I have nothing better to do. Or I just like keeping my TV on, you know. I don't. I mean, I don't think there's anybody who does that really, but you know, still. I think there might be one or two people who've done that, though, at least once. Second shot. Let me tell you this. The grass is really greener on the green. But as Second I was saying shot. about Trixie, uh, I don't really... Like I said, I don't think she's actually one of the... I don't I mean, she... In most of the tour events that I do, she's always almost she's almost always at the v very last event in this game, which she is a pain in the ass, like all the characters are, but or like all the characters that you that I normally go end up going against. But um, but I don't know for some reason she doesn't seem that terrible. I mean, of course I'm gonna be eating my words when it comes to that last tour event or one of the last tour events, but you know still. Like, I don't know. I think there are still more char- I think there are still more than just two other characters who are painting the ass besides her. Could be wrong, though, so... Who knows. 
El Suave is yeah, and I liked how her putt was like completely straight. Eagle. I mean, mine was too, but you know, still. It just tends to happen that it just there's the tendency that she gets the straight putt and I get the ridiculously crooked putt. But actually, I won some of these holes by like her getting a ridiculous putt or something like that, or she missing an easy putt or something like that. But yeah, and it's kind of unfortunate that I actually had to go through all nine holes. I uh, I was hoping I'd actually end it much quicker than that, but that's okay. Cause it didn't take too long to it didn't take very long to actually you know beat her or whatever. Beat her like Chris Brown, bitch. No, I was kidding. Uh, <laughs> but man, that ball seemed like it had wings. What if I croak like a frog if I actually make Trixie um, ready for a little tea party. If I have any real purpose. No, wait, there are obviously Croak. 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 Okay. I'll, I'll stop that. That's annoying. <laughs> Second shot. That was a pretty good shot. I was happy with that. I didn't, I didn't give myself a pat on the back per se, but I did. But I did say yay. Or Yahoo. Or, no, I didn't really say that. I, I didn't say that either. I was like, I was like, oh yeah, cool. Like this putt. I think this was the putt that I was talking about that she missed. That was like dead straight and she missed it. But I was okay with that because then that meant I won. And I won. Well, that brings a close to this round. Today's winner is... El And yes, we are the winners! Hey, Alright, excellent vic victory. You no longer suck soon. as much. It's time to see what you've won. You've earned an invitation to play at the sizzling hot tour event called the Heat Rash Invitational. Plus, you can wrap your and stick your fingers around an outrageously cool ecstasy putter. Alright, and I... I actually don't show it off in this video, but I will show it off in the in the next video, so I will see you next time for Garden Stake Stroke Fest Tournament. Yahoo! Alright. Adios.